Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to run a disk check on your Windows 7 computer through a command line or command prompt window. So this should be a pretty quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up the start menu just by left clicking on it one time. And you want to type in command prompt. And the best match underneath program set should come up, should say command prompt. You want to right click on it and then proceed to left click on run as administrator and then when you receive a user account control window you want to select yes so now into this elevated or administrative command prompt window you want to type in chk dsk space and now you want to enter whatever drive windows is installed on so if you're unsure you want to open up the start menu and then go underneath computer Whatever your local disk is, is more than likely where Windows is installed on, and most people should be the C drive. Some people might have the D or the E drive. I've seen X, Y, and Z for the local disk, but for most people, it's going to be C. But you just want to take note of that, because what we're doing in this tutorial is going to really depend on exactly what drive you're using. So, again, CHK, DSK. Now I'm going to enter that C that we were talking about earlier, because my local disk is C. Now I'm going to do a colon, so the two little dots on top of each other. And then I'm going to do another space, and then forward slash F. And then as it appears directly on my screen, you want to hit Enter. And this will take a couple moments. It's going to say that it can't run since the current drive is in use. So what I recommend doing is closing out of any programs or application you have open on your computer. And then once you've done that, I recommend hitting the Y key on your keyboard. So don't spell W-H-Y. Just type the letter Y one time, then hit enter, restart your computer, and then that's basically it guys. So another way to do it also if we closed out of here would be to open up the star menu and then go back under computer. And then if you had other drives in here it could also be useful. So you could always right click on the drive itself and then left click on properties. And then you can go to the tools tab left click on it and then for error checking left click on this check now button and then you would want to make sure it's select automatically fix file system errors as well as scan for an attempt recovery of bad sectors select the start button and again you'll have to schedule a disk check when your computer restarts it's just a different way to do it but I thought I would just throw both in this tutorial but I do hope this brief video was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.